Hi guys, so today I'm going to be showing you this really Christmassy look. It's so easy to do, it's quick and it's really really pretty. So it's like a red and gold eye with some simple lashes too. So let's get started. So here I have my face cream and this is the Vitamin E face cream from The Body Shop. Then I'm going to use my True Match foundation. I use about one pump and I'm using a damp Real Techniques sponge to put that on. I love this foundation, it's great. Next I've got my Urban Decay Naked Skin Concealer and I'm using it to conceal and highlight at the same time. And I also use this as a base on my eyelids before I put my shadows on. And again, I'm just gonna blend that in. Blend, blend, blend. I found this so therapeutic to do. I absolutely blend, love it. Next I've got my Mary Kate setting powder and I'm just putting this on anywhere I've put the concealer. Uh, this just keeps me matte throughout the day and I absolutely love the finish of this. It doesn't go cakey, it's not too thick, it's really, really lovely. It's a good base as well. Next I've got my bronzer and this is just a Kiko, this was a limited edition bronzer. I love it, it's matte, it doesn't have any sparkle to it but it's really nice just to warm your face up again after putting on the concealer. Absolutely stunning. So next I'm taking my Anastasia Beverly Hill Contour Palette and I'm taking the middle shade which is like a grey toned contour shade and I'm going to use this on my cheekbones and I'm also going to connect this up to my sort of forehead as well just to give me more of a bronzy look, absolutely love it. And a little bit underneath the jawline too. I'm also going to slightly contour my nose with the same shade again. I just love how this looks, it's really simple, it's really quick but it's quite effective and I also link it up to my brow bones just so it looks like nice and seamless. Next I'm taking the sort of pink tone highlighting and I'm just putting this under my eyes a little bit, middle of my forehead and my sort of top of the cheekbones just before I highlight, it gives a nice base for that I think. Here I have a me, this is an eyeshadow called Twinkle, but look at this colour guys, this is like the most beautiful pink tone highlighter ever, I only use it on my cheekbones because it's very very sort of strong highlight, it is stunning, it, it just catches the light beautifully, I'm in love with it. Then I'm taking my Mary Luminizer and I'm using this as my normal highlighter down sort of the centre of my nose and my chin and my forehead as well, and this just gives a really nice like glow, love it love doing the little bit on the tip of my nose too, so cute. Next, I'm taking the Graveyard Girl Swamp Queen palette. I adore this palette, my sister got it for me and I love it. I'm using this sort of creamy one as a base and that's called Big Baby, I love that. Then I'm taking the colour Sassy Bun, which is one of my favourite colours in the palette. Just as like a central sort of graduating tone. It's like a gold metallic colour and it's absolutely stunning, I'm in love with it. Next I'm taking this highlight shade and I'm using this as an inner corner highlight and I'm also going to run it slightly underneath my eye as well. This is the Makeup Revolution Iconic Pro 1 palette and I'm taking this like red toned, it's such a Christmassy colour. I could wet my brush and make it more intense but I don't want to, I just want to get that like metallic sheen and I'm putting this on the outer corner and I'm blending it in. Then I'm taking a clean fluffy brush and I'm blending it at the top as well. One of my other favourite colours in this palette is called Dogman and it's this beautiful red-orange tone and I'm using this just to deepen up the colour even more. Then I'm going to run it underneath my eyes, of course, just to link it all together and then blend it out just so it's not too harsh. Then this is the feature liner from Bourjois, it's a really nice felt tipped liner and it's stunning to do flicks with and I'm addicted to flicks. So a really simple small flick for today, nothing too crazy, nice and simple. Then I'm going to curl my lashes because mine are sad and straight, so I'm curling them before I apply my mascara and this is the full slash effect from L'Oreal Paris which is my favourite mascara at the moment, absolutely adore it, it's great. For lips today I'm keeping it simple, this is the MAC Easy Bay Matte Lipstick, that's very hard to say, and it's this beautiful like just a pretty soft neutral brown tone and I'm in love with this so much, so easy to apply. For lashes today, I'm going to use the Eyelore Lengthening Lashes number 116. These are really, really cute. I love them. And it was at this point I remembered I hadn't done my brows. So this is just a really simple powder I use from H&M, actually, from years ago. But it's just the right tone. It's not too red, not too dark. Filling them in really simply. And guys, that's it. That is the look. It's like a glowy Christmas look. I'm in love with it. I think I'm actually going to wear this on Christmas Day. Let me know if you enjoyed this style of video because I really enjoy doing the voiceovers, it's the first one I've ever done. Um, let me know what you think and don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't already guys. 